What's good, YouTube, man? It's your boy, D-Mail and Louis, back with another video. And as y'all can tell from the title, man, we got number one Alabama versus Vanderbilt. Incredible upset. So look, y'all, I mean, as the world probably knows by now, Alabama did get upset to Vanderbilt. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm here to react to it. Yeah, man. Ain't nothing to do it but to do it, man. Let's get right into this video. Let's see how Alabama lost. Junior Sherrill is back for Vanderbilt. Remember, they beat Virginia Tech, Virginia Tech here at home to open the season and lost in double overtime two weeks ago to Missouri at Texas A&M before going to New Mexico State last year. And they go with the jet sweep, and A.J. Newberry found a little bit of room and gets wrestled down at the 35 by Deontay Lawson. That'll be a Vanderbilt first down on its second play of the game at one. And he finds Alexander, beautiful block on the edge from Stowers, and that's a first down, pardon me, A.J. Newberry. And how about Eli Stowers trading in his quarterback position to run tight in? Along with back here with Clark Lee. Empty back Not. and he hits his man on a slant. That's Quincy Skinner. Okay, that boy Skinner died knows. on his feet to fight for a few more. It turns into a 13-yard gain, and his helmet got ripped off at the end. No flag. Oh, yeah, I like that. Let them play. Let Run them play heavy ball. early on and out of throw. Pavia hangs a U-turn in the backfield. Wants to go deep. And he floats it down the sideline for a first down to Stowers. I ain't gonna lie. It's, it's shit like that that wins you games like this, though. Left side, lowers his shoulder. And powers yeah. to the goal. It's like out-of-body shit like that that wins you games like this. Like him him scrambling like the, the Vandy QB, scrambling out, throwing, the, you know what I'm saying, left side. Oh, He's like, in and yeah, like out of body, just on a like, seven yard, they just played their best game. Score. Early season candidate for the low man trophy. PFT would be excited. Hey, and hey, get in there. That's a strong run, though. Huh? Legs into the end zone huh? for the Commodores. He's inside the numbers. Strong run, though. What you got, Milro? Milro goes the opposite way, but it's batted down at the line of scrimmage. Shit. Got Milro. It's mustard on that snap. Milro near side. Batted up, and it is intercepted. Oh. Fontenet to the corner. Mm. He's in. And Bandy's got a two score lead on a 28 yard interception return by Randon Fontenet. Yeah, to Ball the crib. That Brandon boy tipped it up, Fontenet caught it, and took it to the crib. This defense because they needed more dog in them. Oh, whoa, whoa, Wills. Oh, is that copyright? He gets the doors on the board again. I thought he stepped out at the one. The far official said he was over the goal line with that stretch, and yeah, looks like it was line. over the line Ooh, before that left foot come down. But have they sent a message? I ain't got a lot here in the opening minute. Damn. And the doink knocks it off to the right, and a miss from the kicking game. But that's bad. Vanderbilt up 13 nil, and now helping. What you got, his three Not another pick. Milro over the middle okay. finds CJ Dupree. He's okay. got a lot of green. And he takes it into the You got a foul on Ryan Williams, man. Foul Ryan Williams. After 47 yards. Vandy drops into coverage and wide open Dupree again. He took a lick. Ooh. Second and goal. A hole on the left side and a step through for Jan Miller. Okay. And Alabama's on the board on an eight yard touchdown run. Early, early, hey, everyone, early answer. Wheels here with a reminder to subscribe. That boy wheels through the glasses on. you watching right now are not sub to the channel. Thanks everyone, and I hope. That boy wheels look mad as hell. Look, hey, why wheels look mad then a bit? Look, he look mad. He look mad saying that. Eighty, eighty-seven percent of y'all are not subbed up. Like, look, look at him. Look at him. Why wheels look mad? He look mad as hell. Look, listen. Hey everyone, Wheels here with a reminder to subscribe, as about 90% of you watching right now are not sub to the channel. Thanks everyone, and I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. He's smart because you put it early in the video, because people can kind of skip it at halftime. You ain't going to skip it in the beginning of the video. Option. Here's Alexander. He's got yeah, that was some college. That was some NCAA 25 type shit. By Devontae uh, Smith, was tough. pardon me, Deontay Lawson. I should be wearing zero more often. Jesse Murko, the Aussie, punched it away. Fair catch taken at about the 10. Illegal numbering on the receiving team. There were two number twos in the game. That five-yard penalty will result in a first down. That is a massive mistake. Two of these teams are heavily penalized. 
And four down territory, as you heard him mention, they don't need all eight. Pavia takes it himself and got hog tied as he picked up the first down. And they're going to add some penalty yards yeah, to that as Jihad the? Campbell <laughs> got him on the face mask. You don't have to worry about going for it on fourth down if you convert third down. I ain't gonna lie, that's a tough run. That's a tough play. Oh, yeah, face mask, yeah. Got hit and it's batted at the line of scrimmage, but the hit will draw a flag. Roughing the passer. Personal foul, roughing the passer. Forcible contact above the shoulders on the defense number 34. Automatic first down. will be enforced half the distance of the goal from the previous spot and carries an It wasn't that he hit him, it was where he hit him. Now nah, that was kind of soft, Bobby though. Keeps it. Yeah, that was, I ain't gonna lie, I would have seen that. I ain't gonna lie, I'd have seen through that one. I ain't gonna lie. Third and one, goal line, he's keeping it. I ain't gonna lie, he's keeping it. Just to pick up the first down, we'll see where they Did he get it? I don't know if he got that. And that'll be a first down spot. They'll have first and goal just outside the one. Threw it out of this That's formation tough. against Missouri two weeks ago. You taking it. They'll run it, and another stretch, and this one's good enough. Mm. Cedric Alexander with the touchdown plunge from a yard out. That's tough. Vandy strikes again. I ain't gonna lie, Vandy beating them pretty bad the right earlier, though. You see Steven now, pulling around I don't know if it was the upset as in, like, Vandy just dominated the them or, like, great job keeping those knees Alabama came back. Before the ball crosses the plane. And fast, Let's find out. Pushing you around. Well, in a series of dates in 1903, we could have the thriller of all thrillers between Bama and Vandy. Here's Henderson. Lost the football. Oh, that's Vandy. That's Vandy boy. That's Vandy boy. It's like grab that's Vandy Bull. That's Vandy Bull. That's Vandy Bull. The Commodores outnumbered in their own stadium have the momentum on the West End. That's Vandy Bull. That boy slipped. Daniel Henderson was a kickoff specialist in high school, and I think they might have his elbow down before this ball comes loose. There you see possession, elbow on the ground. Video evidence shows that the runner's elbow was down with possession of the ball. The receiving team will remain possession. You got lucky, boy. You got saved with that one. Rush again. Ball on Lotto. Milrow uncorks it for a first down to Ryan Williams. Well, he is special in a lot of different ways for this Alabama offense. Good protection for Jalen Milrow. Nice pocket. And you almost. Oh. Well, he was bobbling that. This catch by Ryan Williams was overturned to incompletion. The replay booth said he never had firm control. You have to have firm control with the foot on the ground. And the booth said that did not happen. And so instead of a third down conversion, Bama will be forced to punt it away. Mm -mm -mm. Not using personnel and formations. Well, no luck. Pavia gets Ooh. hit in the backfield but escapes. Good blocking on go the block. edge. Good block. Good block. Ooh, good block. And Diego Pavia takes another shot as go he block. carries it across the sideline for a first down. They keep it on the ground, and there's a huge hole for A.J. Newberry. I ain't gonna lie, they run their offense the with Pavia pretty well. Like, they, they know how to down. integrate him in the run game. Like, they're, they're pretty good with that. Pavia goes down the sideline, man. Coverage, it is incomplete. 51, that's a tough kick. Taylor's got the distance, easy. and he splits the uprights. That's easy. Vanderbilt leads Alabama 23-7. We need our best 11 players on the field no matter what. Hand off to Justice Haynes who squirts free. That's enough for a first down, but this Alabama offense, Bama just one of three on third downs. A lot of traffic in the pocket and he's delivered on time. Oh my, what a hit. And a flag down and maybe targeting. targeting. Damn. That's football though, man. It's like I mean I didn't really see the review. Dozens, I hope it's more than the review, so I can't say that it was uh, targeting them. But they try to run it off left tackle. Thank you, gentlemen. Justice Haynes, uh, second and one, picks up the first down. Milrow hands it off. There's a huge hole. Mm. Jim Miller down the sideline. Of I was about to say Milrow not running enough. I mean that's a good run. That's a great run. But I was about to say Milrow not running enough. Touchdown. Space okay. Run okay, Bama. Second of the game. Good answer. Tom, watch bottom right of your screen. I think you'll see the receiver block right there. Number 18. It's Caleb Odom. 
Here's they got the ball back. Oh, they started with the ball at third. Man. Okay. Okay, Milro, get in your bag a little bit then, Milro. Bang, get in your bag a little bit. Huh. Ryan Williams. Results in an Alabama first out. Milro looking for Williams. Dang. Comes near side. He took a hit. I ain't gonna lie. They took a high school kid. Got him playing college football in the SEC. That's tough. There you go, Milro. There you go, Milro. Dang. There we go, Milro. Okay. Okay. Tyler Booker and Parker Brailsford cleared the way. That's so tough, though, bro. Ryan Williams really, bro, he really young as hell, bro. Four man rush. Pavia reverse pivot. And I can't say. One thing about Alabama, I don't never root for Alabama the team. But I ain't going to lie. Some of my favorite receivers, bro, have went to Alabama, bro. No cap, bro. Devontae Smith. Feel me? Like, bro, I ain't gonna lie. It's, it's, it's a couple of Bama receivers, like, I'm really, really fans of. Bro. Quincy Skinner is gonna be brought down short. Not out of the shotgun. They're two, three, and fourth down this year. Pavia wants to throw. Oh. He goes down the middle. It is caught. Touchdown. Oh, shit. That age. That's how you beat Alabama, though, bro. You got to go for shit like that on fourth down. Them, they was in field goal range, was they? Yeah, they was in. I mean, his career long, so it would have been it would have been a tough field goal. But they they sort of was in field goal range. And plus, they was at the the one. They could have ran the ball. They just cho they chose to go deep for a touchdown. Yeah, that that's the type of that's the type of stuff that's going to win you games. I ain't going to lie. That's yeah. Especially when it when it works, <laughs> when shit like this works, yeah, this is how you win games. I got a lot with pressure. That's tough, bro. That was accurate throw, great catch. That's tough. I can't cap. That was tough. That might be the most Diego Pavia play ever. I think it's designed to be a quick throw time. You see there, it's not there. He keeps Damn. it alive. Sees one on one coverage, decides to go deep. That's tough. Justice Haynes is the running back on this one. Milro looking deep down the sideline. It is caught by Williams. He springs free. And well, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Ryan Williams, bro. Golly. I ain't gonna lie. Milro is the king of that, too, bro. I ain't gonna cap. Like, they get a touchdown, like the other team scores a touchdown. Miro go right back and get a big ad, like big play touchdown. Like, bro, Alabama, Ryan, Ryan Williams, especially, bro, like, hey, he nice, bro. He's tough, bro. He is in for an Alabama touchdown. A 58 yard catch and run for the emerging superstar. That's tough, How bro. How did he not get out of bounds? How did he not step over the line even before the ball got uh, to him? Uh, Look at the body control. Hey, he cannot be hey. serious. It's because he's young, bro. But, like, he, he's young with, like, the Ness. Another first down. Stowers past midfield. And he finally gets ridden down in Alabama territory. Damn. Newberry's got a first down. He's got more, and he takes it inside the 20. Pavia looking to throw. Nope, it's a draw. A pump fake and a flag on the play as he delivers to the sideline. And it is a bandy touchdown if it stands. The former walk on Richie Hoskins. But this one's coming back. Holding on the offense number 50. A 10 yard penalty will be enforced in the previous spot for the replay of third down. Bama brings only four. Nearly another hole. Pavia takes off down the sideline and gets tackled from behind. Pressure on his shoulders here. And he absolutely drills it. Okay. His freshman season when he was the backup quarterback. Yeah, Mari Cooper. Milro has time over Dang. the middle. That's caught. They utilize their tight ends beautifully. Said he saw him watch, watch him run one route, and he knew immediately he was their guy. Milro to the perimeter again. This is Jeremy Bernard. Those three hung out together growing up. He was always the youngest and the smallest. Milrow directing, and he gets drilled. Lots of football. 
Oh, he was so comfortable. He was too comfortable in the pocket. And just lost in the game. Really, nigga? Damn, Milro, your, your, your sixth sense, your spidey sense ain't activate. Was was 26 supposed to block him? Did he think 26 was there to block him? Oh my God, Milro, that's crazy. Miles Capers to they say Vanderbilt football. Isa Watava oh my came goodness, out with it after Capers delivered the head of the day in college football. They've also converted a fourth. Pavia rolls out, pumps to the right, and dumps it to Stowers Good for touch. a first down. Pavia throws back shoulder catch and a first down for Vanderbilt. I'm not gonna lie, they taking shots though. Like they really at Bama, like really like you feel me letting it rip, like dang touchdown. Hey, Vandy, Vandy dropped a Van, a Vandy playing, but they playing their best game right now, bro. Hang a lot. This the best I ever seen. This the best I've ever seen Vanderbilt play in my lifetime, bro. I've never seen them play this good, bro. They talking about Pavia like he's in a Heisman race. Bro, by the way, Miro is number one in the Heisman race. They talking about Pavia like he's in that conversation. Like, they talking about he's a magician. He's a master with the ball. What he said, bro? What he just say? Listen to this shit. The master of manipulation. The master of manipulation. Former Theodore Bobcat prowling into the end zone for the Vanderbilt Commodores. The entire offensive line came over to the defense and they said, right here, right now. Jerry Kill said, boys, this is where you buckle up. End this right here. They want to get the ball back to their offense and quickly. Jalen Milrow building his confidence. He got the ball back quickly. Rhythm. Forced out of rhythm here, has to run, unloads deep. Two men there it is. Caught at the sideline, Journey Bernard. About five Pitch. yards downfield. Now second and two, Milrow pumps right, everybody covered, and he gets rid of it for a first down catch in Cole Adams. Fourth and one, game on the line for Alabama late. They reverse it out of there looking for the corner, and it is Brian Williams into the end That's zone. That's a tough play. That's a tough play. touchdown run a for the play. fantastic freshman Ryan Williams, his second touchdown of the game. Tom, you are an absolute buffoon for the rest of your life. If this does not work, you are a complete genius if it does. And a line drive handled at the 14-yard line. And taking a knee is Junior Cheryl. No risk. On second and 12. That's smart. That's mature. Javier dumps it off. Room up the sideline. And a Vanderbilt Stay in bounds. Smart man. Stay in bounds. First and ten for Pavia. He hands it off. Big room left Damn, side and a first game. down for the Commodores. Again. His last Pavia first down gonna seal it. Keeps it. That's Pavia game. picks up the first down. Damn. The unlikeliest of Damn. Damn, Bama. Damn, Bama. Heroes have built what will be its first ever. Number one, and what an investment they've made in Diego Pavia. This attitude, this program, and the biggest win on the West End. Vanderbilt. Oh, hell no. oh, oh, oh. Diego Pavia very nearly went into the stands to celebrate with his brothers, but instead, that was it. He got to let them storm the field. Thank you for watching the video. If you're a college Look at them. They're coming down the stairs. The wheels, which can be it's funny miles. because, like, especially in the SEC, they don't allow, like, the storm in the field, right? But why does it just feel like it's so easy to storm the field when, like, a big win happens? It's like they just get, they just concede to it. Like, I mean, because realistically, bro, if Andy, if Andy was to win this game before they knew, they're storming this field. It's like, I feel like they just give up. You know what I'm saying? At that point, it's just like, all right, what? You know what I'm saying? Like, they're, they're going to, they're going to, they're going to they're gonna do what they got to do. But shout out Vanderbilt, though, man. I'm saying round of applause.
first win versus number one. You feel what I'm saying? They ain't, they ain't never beat us when we was number one. <laughs> they would never do that. And, um, yeah, they snapped a 23-game losing streak to Alabama. So, hey, shout out to them. Avia went crazy, did his thing. Miro did do. Do y'all think Miro took himself out of the Heisman race with this one? I don't think so. I think how he plays in these next coming weeks is going to really tell. Because, I mean, he got, I mean, don't get it twisted. This is an SEC matchup, but he got some of the tougher games ahead of him. So, I do believe Miro going to get right. And, um, yeah, man, that's all for this video. Y'all hope y'all enjoyed it. If y'all did, make sure y'all leave a like. Subscribe channel if you're new. Turn on post notifications. I'm hot. Y'all next one.